St. Peter and Paul's Church in Washington Square was built somewhere around 1926-27 and is the church of it Italian American community and now of Chinese American community It's a Catholic church and they say that during 1926-27 anarchists tried to bomb the church and damage it but then one person was killed and eventually the the attacks were contained a rich lady by the name of lily hitchcock coit uh, built her property and estate to the san francisco city uh, with a wish to make beautify the city in some way and she did not specify she what she wanted so it was decided to build a tower and coit tower was built at the time of uh, great depression and it was completed i think in 1933 it gives a beautiful view of the bay as well as the skyscrapers and the downtown of san francisco you can also see the bridge across the bay as well as alcatraz the ferry buildings etc the view from the top is gorgeous and uh, there is a lift which takes you up to the top and the last bit you have to climb 37 steps to reach the viewing gallery and the view of the surrounding area is really beautiful and it's a definitely a very nice place to visit in addition to the view from the top what they say is the murals inside the coit tower are also really beautiful and they were created to depict the scene at the time of depression you can either walk down or take a bus to Gerald Square and enjoy the excitement of the crowd as well as uh, beautiful chocolates coffee uh, ice creams etc which are available there you can enjoy the beautiful architecture of the Gerald Gerald Square as well as see the various items on big display and also uh, see the video film which tells the story of Gerald Dilley you can walk down the few steps from Gerald Dilley square and enjoy generally the cool weather and uh, come to the seashore and there are many things to enjoy including uh, irish liquor at uh, bona vista or the painting gallery uh, eyes on which now a movie also has been made and you can also see the maritime museum this area is is wonderful and you can easily spend half a day here